Hi guys, Casey Sangwins at Guarantee RV in Junction City, Oregon. Today I want to show you this Cadassi Legacy Edition 333BHTS CK. That's a lot of letters to, re to remember there. It's a bunkhouse triple slide camp kitchen edition trailer. Let's go around and take a look. You've of course got the full pass through storage up front. Store all your goodies up there. It is separate from, the, from what's underneath the bed so you can put your dirty stuff up here, your camp stuff. Now this trailer has, again, three slides, so you have one, one slide here on the camp side, but the nice thing that they did is they went ahead and put two awnings on it, so you've got still plenty of awning coverage outside of the trailer. You've got the small one here on the slide itself, plus this one over the front door. You've got some outside speakers up there, full entertainment. You've got, you, can, you can mount a TV on the outside, so if you want to watch the big game or big race, whatever you're into. Uh, back here, the CK, the camp, or the case, the camp kitchen part of it is because of this. You've got the outside kitchen. This is the margarita station. You've got a nice little Coleman grill here. Cook up your bacon in the morning um, on a drawer. So you've always got a place to be. You don't have to bring the other one. You've got a little bit bigger fridge out here. Plenty of storage for all your cool beverages, maybe some hot dogs. You've got plenty of drawers. Lots of stuff, lots of place to store all of your extra chips, goodies for the kids, whatever you may have. Plus, even though it's not under one of the main awnings, this, this door is plenty high. I'm six foot, 5'12 on a good day, uh, plenty high over my head. I can still stand under it, keep out of the rain. Uh, let's go on inside and take a look to see what's inside. Let's go back to the bunkhouse. This trailer's big bunkhouse, triple slides. One of those slides is in the bunk room. So if you've got kiddos that need some space inside, this is it. Okay, you've got space sleeping for up to four very comfortably. You got a nice, fairly wide bunk up here. Um, you've got this bunk here that does fold down or up out of the way, however you want to look at it. You got bunks there, and then you've got the the fold out easy chair, whatever you want to call them, is down there that fold out and make into roughly a queen size bed on the floor. Plenty of place for the kids for the kiddos to camp out on the ground. Uh, over here. You've got area to hook up a TV, so all the plugs are there if you want to hook up a TV, TV player or TV or a DVD player, gaming system, whatever you want to do. If you're, you know, maybe you're not using this for camping so much as, as traveling and you want them inside on a rainy day, give them something to do. Um, a nice ladder to be able to get up to this top bunk is always nice so they're not climbing on the furniture. And you've got some fairly good amount of storage to store all of their stuff. Moving forward into the rest of the trailer, you've got a nice couch here. This is a full height of bed couch. So it's a, a three piece trifold sofa that will fold out into roughly, maybe a little bit narrower than a queen size bed, but a full bed that you can have extra guests sleeping on. And it is straight across from the TV and the fireplace. The fireplace is electric, but it does put out heat and creates a nice ambiance. Got nice storage up above, not overly deep, but good storage for, for some stuff. Um, and then of course your dinette. This is just a standard booth dinette. It does fold down into a bed as well. Um, but you've also got storage underneath with the doors to make it a little easier to get into. Moving over into the kitchen, this has a great kitchen. If you've got all the kids to fill the bunk room, you're gonna need a lot of kitchen area. You've got plenty of pantry space. Store all your extra bags of chips and bread and whatever else they eat. You got a nice big full size fridge and freezer. Keep all the cold stuff cold. Plenty of storage up above the stove. Got a nice three burner stove with an oven and this stove has the glass top. So if you're not using the stove, you've got extra counter space, extra places to, to prep meals, make sandwiches, whatever else you've got to do. Of course, microwave over here, more storage, more cabinet, storage for plates and stuff and storage all over down here plus more drawers you got a nice fairly deep drawer there a couple up here for your silverware and whatnot and of course you got your sink nice solid sink covers for the dual sink um, again it all goes back to making extra counter space when these are in that's very sturdy very solid nothing's going to break those um, let's move forward into the into the bedroom area and bathroom. 
up here the bathroom first of all nice large bathroom again more storage plenty of storage for all the towels and and bathroom accessories and equipment that you may need the nice big rounded full stand-up shower plenty of height in here again um, you do have a medicine cabinet and a nice sink uh, toilet in the corner, plenty of room, very comfortable. This is a Jack and Jill bathroom, so you can walk through the bathroom or down the hall into the bedroom. Gives you plenty of room in the bedroom to move around. Again, you've got more storage, more uh, wardrobe space up on, on either side of the bed, plus plenty of space up above. You've got power on both sides of the bed, so you know whatever you got to plug in. If you do have a CPAP, there's there's power and plenty of space to put it on on both sides of the bed. Um, and of course, you got even more storage underneath the bed. Now again, this trailer is built by by Coachman. It's the Coachman Catalina. If you have any questions, please feel free give me a call. Again, my name is Casey Sanguins. My phone number is 541-953-9171. Love to hear from you. Thanks.